Welcome to SpaMedica.com TV, Dr. Stephen Mulholland, your host. Today our story, Quick Fixes. Little things, non-invasive things that people can do to look great. And sometimes when you add up those quick fixes, non-surgical, -in non non-invasive body contouring enhancements, leg veins, fat reduction, cellulite improval, or in the face, Botox, fillers, facial rejuvenation, lasers and lights, you can get a big wow. You could look five, six, seven years, eight years younger with very little effort and very little risk. Let's take a look at one person's quick fix story. After getting rejected from the Beautiful People website and after careful consideration I've decided to meet with Dr. Mulholland for a consultation uh, just basically to go over um, some concerns of mine, my appearance, and see what recommendations he has for me. Okay, Cassandra, you are in the entertainment industry, you're an actor, you're mm -hmm. 28, turning 29, so you're not getting any younger. In an industry where ageism is paramount, you look in the mirror, can you top four or five things that bother you? Basically, I'd like to see the lines. Show me face. those lines. Show me the lines. Right here. Okay. The furrow. Oh, you're a very <laughs> tense frowner. <laughs> um, the little line in my nose and the tip. Something that's kind of bothered me my whole life is the tip of my nose, and I hadn't really thought about it until today. And just going over uh, the details with Dr. Mulholland, um, he made me realize that it's something that could be really well fixed in a very short amount of time. So in our plan today, frown for me. You have very active uh, muscle here, so we're going to put a little bit of Botox. My ideas on beauty are pretty much that everyone is different. It's an extremely subjective thing, you know, to say to one person, you're beautiful, you're not. Um, I think in different people's eyes, different people are beautiful. So I think that'll complete the picture. You will be a work of art. Are you ready to go get going? Okay, I'm ready. Let's go. Do people cry? Tears of joy, that's all I see. Okay. Tears of joy. I know that there's going to be a bit of discomfort during the procedure. Dr. Mulholland said that there are definitely needles involved. We're going to do some freezing first. And there's a little bit of sting to that. Okay. It, there's a little bit of pain. It doesn't hurt nearly as much as uh, growing old as an actor without trying to, uh, to battle the, the aging process. Ultimately, it's, it's going to be worth it. I'm, I know I'm taking a risk, but it's something that I'm, I'm willing to do because the outcome is what I want. I want to get on the Beautiful People website. And this will take away the pain discomfort when I'm actually putting the filler in, which would be a lot more painful than putting up a little bit of local anesthetic. I'm a little bit afraid of needles, so we'll see what happens. Um, I've been afraid of needles since I was a little kid. Probably all those immunizations or something, but yeah, um, just gonna have to deal with it. I'm coming up under your eye here where you're a little bit sunken. We have that, what we call a tear trough for that dark sunken area. And this will um, bring up volume to fill it out, make it look smooth so you don't have that a little bit of that trough under your eye that does contribute to looking tired. Something that I hadn't really considered were the dark circles under my eyes. He pointed them out and said it, it really does make me look tired and sunken. I guess it's good to know that from his professional standpoint, that's something that I need some, some help with. For me, the price of beauty is, is minimal. I mean, if, if it's going to help me advance in my career, if it's going to help me get uh, further, then it's definitely something that I, I can do. Um, it might not be for everybody, but this is where I'm willing to go now. It's been a few days since my procedures, and I haven't seen Tara in those days, so I'm really excited to see her reaction uh, to the work that I've gotten done. Um, excited, nervous, but uh, mostly excited to see her reaction. Cassandra, are you home? Oh my god! <laughs> you look so beautiful! Oh! Thank you. Thank I you. love your nose, that's the biggest change for sure. I like it too, totally different. Yeah, look, no lines, 
the scar isn't as noticeable. In the end, I'm really happy with, with the outcome. Uh, I feel like this will definitely uh, further my career. People are really going to see a fresher, more revived me, and I'll get work out of it. So you want to help me take a picture? Sure. Okay. Since I got rejected the first time around, I think the picture might have been what did it. So this time, I'm going to make sure that the second picture is perfect. You look amazing. If they don't let you in, I don't know what to say because you look really good now. Thank you. Oh, I like that one. Let's see. Yeah. Oh, that's a keeper. Yeah. Okay, sure. that's the okay. one I think. One of the pictures that Tara took is perfect. So I'm going to submit it to the website and I'm positive they're going to accept me. It was a really long 72 hours that I had to wait, but it was finally up. And when I got the email, I was a little bit nervous before I opened it up. But I opened it up and I got in. Oh, sweet, sweet. I got a call Peter. I knew that there was going to be pain involved with the procedure, but when it was actually taking place, all the needles going into my face really, really hurt. But getting the email from beautiful people just validated completely all the work that I'd gotten done. Come on, pick up. My agent Peter is going to freak when I call him and tell him the good news. Cassandra, my superstar. Hey Peter, how's it going? Good, good. How are you, Cassandra? I'm great. I got some good news, actually. Let's have it. Well, you remember that website I was telling you about? That's the one that uh, Jay's getting a lot of work on, right? I got accepted to it. Oh, that's great. Congratulations. Thank you. I'm super excited. I, uh, I sent in a new shot, uh, so I'm going to be forwarding you some new headshots as well. And I guess you're going to be getting lots of phone calls in the next little while. That's what I like to hear. Cheeks, what's going on back there? What you do you mean? You got your butt done too? <laughs> nope, it's all natural. There must be some special genes because that looks good. <laughs> My goodness. Thanks. The casting director from this new TV series saw me on Beautiful People, and that's how I got this big audition. So it's working. And the earrings? Gold ones? Too yeah. much? Or? No, they just had the right amount of pop. And I think I'd put a little bit of blush on these. New cheeks of mine. Yes, that will <laughs> definitely accentuate the cheeks, for sure. This is pretty much the biggest audition I've ever had to date, so I'm super excited. Now, how many people are, are going to be auditioning for this? Uh, well, it's down to the short list, which I made, so not as many as it first started out. I am really confident, more so than I've ever been before on any other audition. So, what do you think? I think you have this for sure. I think I have it too. I know it's because of my new appearance and because of the site, so I'm very pleased with that. Wow, what a great outcome and no surgery, no scalpel. If you're interested in non-surgical enhancements, face or body quick fixes, please check us out at spamedica.com. Email a consult request or call us. Looking forward to seeing you, Dr. Stephen Mulholland your host for SpotMedica.com TV. Take care.